Hi, I'm Craig Phillips. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to install this floating shelf a stronger way. And it happens to be a lack shelf, or commonly known as a floating shelf. Therefore, you do not see any brackets. They're cheap and cheerful. However, they can be a little bit rattly when they're fitted to the wall because that bracket that's built inside there is fixed in. But when this is slid on, you do tend to get a little tiny bit of movement in there. And that's where the multi-use can be really helpful. So the bracket slides out of the back and is shaped like this. And this is fitted to the wall. You find your location, decide what height you're going to be. And I'm going to put a little pencil mark right in here. So that's where I'm going to drill my first hole. But before you drill into any walls, always check first that there is no electric cables behind there or water pipes. We've got a socket right down the bottom here. So if I turn this on, fold the sides, I go across the area where I'm about to drill to see if there is anything behind there and it's telling me there's not. If there was, the alarm would go off on this and of course you'd have to change your location. Now a little tip to catch your dust when you're drilling, because you don't want it all over your skating boards, get yourself an envelope, put a little bit of sticky tape on it and put it underneath. Once you drill, it catches all the dust. Now the manufacturers normally supply screws and plugs in here. However, these screws are about 38 millimeters. So I always try to go a little bit above that and use a 50 millimeter screw. Place that plug in, push it in as far as you can. Take a little hammer, hammer it down so it's flat. And that isn't flat. Next, place your bracket over your plug. Start to put the screw in, hand tighten it and then take your cordless drill and drive it in. Now at this point, we don't have to get it level. It's going to be loose. The next stage is to take your spirit level and make sure you get that perfectly level. So now we can drill these two and these two. And then once them two screws are screwed in either side, you can come back to the loose one in the middle and drive that in nice and tight so your bracket is really solid to your solid wall. So then take your shelf, place it over the actual brackets and you'll see it slide back to the wall. However, the problem I have with these, now if you feel that it's got a little tiny bit of rattle in it, just a little bit and also I found speaking from experience I've fitted hundreds of these on makeover shows when I place my spilt level on there now the front of that is dropping down just a fraction it's about three or four millimeters that's where the multi-use is going to fix it I'm going to be placing bottles and glasses on here out of reach of the children so it must be secure so then Remove it and apply some of your multi-use now all the way along the back of here, the length of the bracket and in the two holes. Even apply some along the edge of the bracket. Nice and secure now. And perfectly level as well. So that's how you install a floating shelf. If you're looking for more inspiration or how-to videos, Check us out on all social media handles and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for the full videos.